And this is a little off topic, but I, I did see the news uh, put out earlier today that Broner and Malinazzi uh, pulled in 1.3 million views, and, and, and it sounds like it's getting even better. How, I mean, are you guys pleased with the success that you're having? I mean, obviously, I'm sure you are pleased, but were you expecting those kind of numbers for a fight like that? No, I was, I was uh, to be honest, I wasn't expecting that kind of number. You know, I was expecting a big number, but it was a positive surprise, and I think what it showed you, that Showtime, uh, you know, has clearly caught up to HBO, and so like the only, the only, the last thing HBO could hang their hat on was their larger viewership numbers, because they do have maybe 25, 30 percent more subscribers. But when you have you now Showtime doing the same or better numbers in HBO with a much smaller subscription base, it shows you that Showtime is doing something right. Showtime is without any question. I mean, you know. We the people don't need to bullshit each other. Um, in the boxing industry, we have to be honest. And honest truth is, Showtime is number one when it comes to boxing. <laughs> were you surprised? Actually, I was kind of surprised that you guys even offered the fight to HBO. But were you surprised that they turned down the Hopkins uh, Stevenson fight? Well, you know, I think that whole thing initiated by HBO about uh, you know. Uh, I don't want to do business with Golden Boy anymore. I think that shows you that is somebody that that's a management team which is acting out of anger. Um, and no matter what you do, whether you're a boxer, whether you're you know a TV executive, or whoever you are, when you act out of anger, you make the wrong decision. Right? Because you make emotional decisions. And I don't think they should make emotional decisions. I think they should do what is the best interest of their subscribers and their shareholders. And I think going to do a fight with Stevenson against Travoris Clout, I'm hearing, or anyone else, uh, after after Bernard Hopkins dominated Travoris Clout to the point where it wasn't even competitive anymore. Right. Uh, and now, instead of doing Stevenson and, and Hopkins, they want to do Stevenson and Travoris Clout. I mean, you're going to have to scratch your head and say, what the hell is going on? Right. <laughs>